Hey guys, welcome back to Meromedics. In this video, we are going to discuss about the topic penicillin. So, last video, we discussed about antibiotics and its classification. Uh, beta lactam antibiotics and the classification under the Veranadana. So, a beta lactam antibiotics under the Veranana, penicillin, cephalosporin, monobactams, and all. So, in this video, Namala penicillin a petty detail at Padikam Bogiana. So, yeah, as a small introduction, it was discovered by Sir Alexander Fleming in 1928. It is the first antibiotic to be used clinically and it has bacteriocidal action. So, in the last video, and bacteriocidal and bacteriostatic and then explain to you know the link will be in the description box so we'll start with the mechanism of action of penicillin in mechanism of action uh, in order to understand that so i'm not very good at drawing but for you guys i drew something yeah this is the bacterial cell wall it has peptidoglycan layer. So, bacterial cell wall, the peptidoglycan layer, layer which is binded by amino acid chain. So, our peptidoglycan layer, amino acid chains. Our chain, this peptidoglycan layer, we have cell wall, bacterial cell wall integrity shape. So, what penicillin does is here there is penicillin binding protein. So, there is a protein called penicillin binding protein that is PBP. So, E penicillin one that E PBP are to bind up. I'm going to bind I carinale the either some of that is in an erna E amino acid chain one that rupture that is the cross linking and then inhibit out no I'm going to cross linking inhibit the inhibit I a picture load and then I'm going to come back to then this pepper like a layer no run and I am rupture of an all of a sudden and ultimately it will leads to the rupture of uh, cell wall and it will cause autolysis and cell death. So, this is the mechanism of action of penicillin. Now, talking about the classification of penicillin, on the basis of source, we have to write natural and semi-synthetic. Natural is penicillin G and penicillin V. Then, uh, semi-synthetic is penicillin So, we have to just go through the uh, first letter that is OCDAA that is OCD O for oxacillin C for cloxacillin D for dicloxacillin A for ampicillin and uh, another A for amoxicillin ampicillin amoxicillin as you know common antibiotic which is given for uh, fever and sore throat and all so next is on the basis of resistance to acid acid stable penicillins under acid unstable itola penicillin under acid stable very much let's start with penicillin V uh, here, penicillin G and penicillin V are natural penicillins, but it is penicillin V one that is acid stable on penicillin G acid unstable on it. OCD again, oxacillin, cloxacillin, dicloxacillin. Then, if it is methicillin, naficillin and piperacillin. Next, on the basis of the route of administration, so we know uh, route of administration of medication, oral, parenteral, oral again, OCD, AA, penicillin V. Then, uh, parenteral, methicillin, nafacillin, piperacillin, penicillin, G. Next, on the basis of spectrum of activity. Based on spectrum of activity, we have antibiotics in narrow and broad. Now, we have to extra and alkyl. Intermediate and extended. So, narrow is methicillin, oxacillin, nafacillin and dicloxacillin. Broad is ampicillin and amoxicillin. Then, intermediate penicillin G and penicillin V. Then, extended spectrum that is ticarcillin and piperacillin. So, these are, these are the classification of... Uh, uh, anti sorry penicillins in the therapeutic uses no care so for stress uh, um, antibiotics in the antimicrobial so that is penicillin streptococcal infections such as pharyngitis sinusitis uh, sinusitis or pharyngitis or upper respiratory tract infections in a maximum or medicine in the e penicillin that is uh, yeah pharyngitis sinusitis and all then a pneumococcal infection such as pneumococcal pneumonia meningitis aland syphilis diphtheria rheumatic fever rheumatic heart disease chorea next uh, yeah adverse effect of penicillin include local irritations and hypersensitivity reactions such as rashes, itching, urticaria and fever. Then 
penicillin the duration of action is four to six hours and yeah it can be given through im iv oral and all so that was all about penicillin in penicillin main ayat avare chodikkunna the mechanism of action classification therapeutic uses aanu so that is covered in this video and stay tuned for more videos in next video we will discuss about another classification of antibiotics until that please like share and subscribe to our channel and don't forget to click the bell button and yeah thanks for watching